So I thought, whoa, he's gonna ask me if there's any Pokestops around here, any Pokemon, anything worth checking out. I'm like, yeah, I'll hook you up. That was not the f***ing case. <laughs> hey, what's up, you guys? So, good God, do I have a story to share with you. This literally happened hours ago, and it's fresh in my head, and I'm still a little bit shaken, annoyed, pissed, and... <sighs> So where we begin this lovely story is down the road, over there, like a thousand feet that way. So I was outside riding my skateboard alongside my mom who was running. It's what we do, it's all we have for fun in this freaking town. It's the one thing that keeps me sane during the day is riding my skateboard every day around the neighborhood, around the town, whatever I gotta do. And what caught me by surprise as I was walking around the corner, three Great Danes run out of this neighbor's lawn and into the sidewalk area and scare the ever-living out of Piercy and Meemaw. So naturally, I scream, which caused the dogs to bark even louder at me, which caused me to scream even louder and run even faster in the other direction. So that's what I did. It's all cool. I run away, a little bit startled. I peed my pants a little bit. It's whatever. Life goes on. So that's that. I just get scared by some dogs. Whatever. I continue my skate. My mom's running and it's all cool. And about 10 minutes later is when sh went down. So I'm playing Pokemon Go because I'm addicted and I'm just walking up the street, riding my skateboard. It's a hill. So I'm carrying my skateboard at this point walking until this white truck comes up behind me and stops me dead in my tracks. So I thought, whoa, he's gonna ask me if there's any Pokestops around here, any Pokemon, anything worth checking out. I'm like, yeah, I'll hook you up. That was not the f***ing case. He stops me and he says, in my best impression of this man. <clears throat> so you're the boy that's screaming in my front yard with my dogs? Nope. Wasn't me. Oh, hell no. Boy, I saw you walking around with that punk ass skateboard and that punk ass man bun, walking around scaring my, my great Danes. I don't think so. What you think, honey? Where are you? Honey? She's in that trunk. Oh yeah, the um, the bears you have in your front yard? Yep, scary, some scary looking f**ks. You know, I don't think you're a bad kid and everything. I don't think you're a bad kid. But if you go near my lawn one more time, my dogs will attack. They have no electric fence, no f**king leashes. <laughs> Boom. Cool. One more time I see you in my lawn, I swear to God, those great tanks will attack. Full force! You're a good kid. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. So I skate along and I keep going. So my mom's in front of me and she watches this whole thing happen. And so she's like, oh, what was that about? I'm like, they told me to never walk by their house again and to never scare their dogs. <laughs> because that's what they said. So the people in the truck are doing a Yui and my mom walks in front of the truck because that's what she does. And she's... I'm bleeding. Hang on. Intermission. So my mom ends up stopping the truck dead in their tracks and it like skids, it breaks hard. It's, it was intense. I'm like, holy sh**, we're gonna get killed. Mom, cut it out. So then my mom talks to them. She's like, um, that was my son. What did you have to say to him? And she's like, oh yeah, there's these kids, they're running around in our lawn, messing with our dogs. And she's like, your dogs came out of nowhere and scared the sh** out of me and my son and she just kept going off saying stuff like that and the guy was not having it the guy and his wife they're both a little bit on the like we wave our flags around we love trump type of people you know the people that you know the people i'm talking about you know those types of people so while that's going down i'm like i'm a vlogger so i you know i take my cell phone out and i record the entire thing roll that clip You know, the footage isn't very helpful in a police situation because it kind of makes him look like the good guy, but you know, he was really an But I wish I kept recording. What happened next? 
Oh my god! My mom was running on the right side of the road as you're supposed to, and that's where the dogs were. The house is on the right side of the road, the dogs came out, you get it. The guy said, well, maybe you should start running on the other side of the road. And then my mom said, well, that's not the correct side to run on. And he's like, well, yeah, by my house, that's the correct side because I have my dogs. First of all, what the f does that even mean? Translate, buddy. Translate, Donald. Donald, please translate. <laughs> <laughs> After that, you know, it's my mom. She gets heated. It's going down. God, I wish I hit record again, but I'm an idiot and I'm the worst vlogger in the world. Whatever. Maybe it'll happen again sometime and I promise I'll record it. But let me tell you what happened next. So let me remind you the people in the car are husband and wife. They live together. Let's just, let's just let me just tell you what they had to say to me and me ma. All right. <clears throat> the husband said, Oh, well, maybe you should find another neighborhood to run in because like this is all one big development It's connected by streets as a typical development of houses is set up as he says find another neighborhood to run in my mom flips her shit Mima mode f***ing engaged. Um, this is our neighborhood and I can run wherever the f I want. All right, buddy So then the wife kicks in she's a little crazy. All right, just very classless awful person. All right, so she kicks in and she's like, um, this is not your f***ing neighborhood, honey. <laughs> I love so she says, um, this is our f***ing neighborhood and I can run wherever the f*** I want, all right? And he's, and the husband kicks in and he says, no, no, this street up here, that, that's the f***ing neighborhood. We live in the nice development. What does that even f***ing mean? It's the same neighborhood. The houses are all practically the same, all right? We probably have the same living room. Okay, Donald, we're gonna call this guy Donald for the sake of this video, all right? <laughs> I should have said that sooner. He's Donald. So after that goes down, you know, the practical words are exchanged, you know, they're telling me to suck a d d I think d was thrown in there once, and it ended up with a big old f you to the white truck, and you know, we just kept running that way. And I was playing Pokemon Go, I was live tweeting it, everyone was a little bit scared. <laughs> so then we called 911, animal control came, I don't, I don't know why, the Great Danes probably, I don't know. So the police are at my house questioning me and yeah, and my Mima. Mima's my mom, by the way. If you don't know that by now, figure it out. So yeah, that's about it. But just like the whole like aggression and tension, that guy's definitely been in jail before. No doubt about it, he's a convict. He has time to think about what he wants to do. I've been on watch the whole day, looking out that window. I have, um anything to defend myself, I have uh, my car keys, um, a chapstick, and uh, Jesus to defend myself if he comes to our house. As you could tell, I would do very well in the purge. But just like, you understand, right? Just like the tension and everything that was like happening. It was just so intense and like, you'll do. Bottom line, you I promise you in your lifetime you're gonna deal with a whole bunch of that are just like that and, it, and it's not gonna be the last one that you have to deal with and you just have to you know sometimes just put your middle fingers up and move on with life and yeah that's just how life works and you have to defend yourself stand up for what you believe in and your life will be great but let's hope I never see that guy again because <laughs> I'm really scared he's gonna pull it on my driveway but yeah that was my Wednesday night and yeah I'm a little bit paranoid. <laughs> so before this video ends, I just wanted to say that I have a brand new line of clothing out. The link is down in the description. It is the Love Me campaign. It says Love Me. It has a little bit, it has some lips on it, and it's really cool. Go check it out. There's like pastel pink, blue, gray, black, white, so many colors of t-shirts, and I think they're really cool. And as soon as you order them, they'll ship immediately. And that's the first time I've ever done that, and I hope you guys like it. So yeah, <clears throat> that was a mouthful, and I have dry mouth. Hold up. And another thing, I'm going to Florida on the 21st, and I'm going to have to film a video, and I'll get to get it up for my main channel here, so yeah, expect another video next week. Also, I'll be vlogging my trip, hanging out with g -Maw and Poncho, and also leave some video ideas that you want me to see me do with my Nana in the comments below. So yeah, I'll be checking those out. <laughs> Until then, I will see you guys next week with a brand new video. See you guys later. Bye.